During the second annual Charleston Restaurant Week, 16 local eateries are offering their best at $30 per person. This includes a starter, an entree, and even a decadent dessert. Bridge Road Bistro and Black Sheep Burrito and Brews gave us a behind the scenes look at preparing some of their specialties. At Bridge Road Bistro, the food has a French flair. Chef John Wright serves up grilled pork chops and grilled salmon on the special menu this week. Searing the meat at a high heat in a skillet, the sugars in the brine caramelize to give the meat a nice sweet flavor. The bright peak salmon is seared in a non-stick pan, the best way to prepare fish. Both dishes are finished in the ovens. Cooking up the Bistro's signature vegetable blend of yellow squash, red and green peppers, thumbelina carrots, green beans, and red onions is the next step. Plating the entree takes creativity and skill. Starting with whipped Yukon potatoes, Chef Wright adds the chop, spoons on the vegetables, and drizzles it all with an apricot shallot glaze. To add a special touch, the dish is topped off with garnishes, including a brightly colored orchid, just one of the traditions at the Bistro. Across town at Black Sheep Burrito and Brews, where the atmosphere is a little different, so is the food. There, Jeff Jeremiah Bowen brings a more global cuisine to the Charleston restaurant scene. One of the appetizers on the menu this week starts with a wasabi cashew and crusted ahi tuna that's seared in a hot pan, then cut into thin strips. Looking at food as art, Bowen adds a touch of sesame ginger sauce onto a fried wonton, then carefully stacks on a few strips of tuna. He layers on pickled carrots and daikon, then spoons on a chili marin reduction for a little sweet heat. Last, Bowen sprinkles on green onions. Another appetizer on the menu at Black Sheep also has an international flair. It's a grilled shrimp skewer with a sriracha honey butter glaze. The skewers are laid on a bed of fresh greens sprinkled with pickled cucumber relish chopped cashews, and green onion. The second annual Charleston Restaurant Week is sure to tantalize. You don't want to miss it.